Did you summon child? No? I mean, good luck next time. But if you did, this video is for you. And if you're planning to summon for him, maybe you wait for the last day. Child is an interesting character that is really, really good if you don't have OP damage dealers, but also bad if you have OP damage dealers. I'm going to be talking about why you shouldn't be building his artifacts right now and why you should save your resin for other things. Let's hop right into the video. First, let's talk about my child build. I have child right here. We can go and look at his details. These are his stats. I have him at a 44% crit rate with 128% crit damage. That's good, right? If we go to weapon, I chose a Black Cliff Warbow. I don't have Rust, sadly, or the Battle Pass weapon. So I, you know, I had to make do with what I had. So I went ahead and purchased this and it gives me a really nice crit damage bonus. The press the advantage moves, all right. It's not bad if you're fighting fodder enemies. Now, the most important part of Child's kit is artifacts. Right now, we really don't have any water artifacts. But, what I'm running right now and what I was planning to run was Gladiator's Nostalgia, as you guys can see right here. So, a Gladiator set with a Noblest of Liege set. And, you know, just go to town. But, first, look how good my flower is, you know? Crit damage, crit rate, attack, and energy recharge. Energy recharge, I wish it went more into crit rate, but it's all good. Look at that beauty. My feather isn't too good, right? 311 attack, elemental master is all right. Defense is trash, energy recharge is pretty bad. But I had 21% crit damage on this feather. So I was like, damn, I gotta keep that bitch. And then we head on over to, you know, the hourglass. I'm running Berserker. I'm planning to get rid of this, right? I was planning to get rid of Berserker set to run something like the Noblesse Oblige set, if I can find it um, wherever it is. So the set's right here, and uh, you know, this one's not bad, you get, you get an attack stat. What I'm looking for on the cup is Hydro bonus, because it's the only one that gives you an elemental damage boost. So I'm looking for Hydro damage bonus on here, and look at that, elemental burst damage 20%, it starts scaling like crazy, right? This was my set, this is what I was going to build, because I didn't want to build this other set that everyone uses. Everyone uses this artifact set right here that gives you uh, a crazy amount of damage when you have a shield on you. So you'd run Noel and Crystallize, maybe Diona if you'd want, and you'd deal an extra 40% normal and charge attack damage. Now that's nuts! That's crazy! But the two-piece set's trash. And to do something like this, it's, it's so much effort. Sometimes you just want to go up to someone and just slap them and kill them, you know what I mean? I'm going to go ahead and start talking about why you should save your resin. Alright, you know, I just had to pose beside the homegirl Mana. Alright, so if you guys don't know, other sets already exist for elements. So if we go to artifacts, for example, you'll see we'll have a thunder set, electro damage up, increased damage caused by elemental things that have something to do with lightning, and cooldown. Very right? easily we have one for lightning. Oh, look at that. We have one for wind. Increased world damage by 60%, decreased elemental resistance by the element infused. Nuts. This is amazing for Venti, right? And then we also have one for healers. So for Barbara, you can go ahead and put this on her. Boom. Perfect, right? Uh, we also have one for Geo, right here. We have one for Fi Pyro. We have one for pretty much everything except we have one for physical for damn sake. But we don't have one for cryo and we don't have one for water, which is my main reason I want you to save for child. Now, I'm not just saying just save forever. Don't don't use your resin. Don't use your resin. No, dude. So there's been a leak and I know MiHoYo hates leaks, but I hate MiHoYo. So it goes back and back. I'm going to go ahead and pop it on screen right now. You can see a cryo damage bonus set and a water damage bonus set. Now, this stuff's nuts. This is a shout out to Zenia. I'm going to drop his Twitter link down below. Look at this, bro. First of all, two-piece hydro set. Hydro damage bonus, 15%. Four-piece set. All right, child, relax, man. Four-piece set. After using an elemental skill, increases normal attack and charge attack damage by 25% for 12 seconds. That is such a perfect child set. The 15% hydro damage bonus is amazing, right? And then on top of that, an extra 25% normal attack. Now, the reason, you know, you might be saying, well, the shield one gives me 40%. So, um, it's kind of better. Well, I mean, you can look at it this way. The 15% hydro damage bonus scales off your attack, which is absolutely nuts. It's, it's a lot more than just getting 15% attack, which is nice. 
And then, when you, you can use this whenever you want. You don't need Noel on your team or Diona. You don't gotta do all these crazy setups to get it perfectly done. This is definitely the set you need. So think about it this way. If you start farming artifacts for child right now, you're gonna be wasting your resin. Because you're gonna eventually replace them. So use it right now on books, on gold, on anything you need. The meteorite event. We also got the icebreaker sack on screen yo what's up why are you looking at more like that what the hell uh two piece set cryo damage bonus 15 percent very nice and then this part is just broken now i know this has nothing to do with child but it's still nuts increases damage against enemies that are frozen or affected by cryo by 30 percent that is insane i'm gonna go ahead you know that's all i wanted to say in this video real quick simple short i'm gonna tell you guys to save your resin right now focus on characters you need i need ventis i need officials I'm gonna go ahead and farm their artifacts. I'm saving my condensed resin for child. Right now, every time I have 20 resin, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up Mona's quest. And if I have any condensed resin or anything left over, like these two, I can go ahead and farm characters I need, like Venti. I'm not wasting it on child. That's all I wanted to say. If you guys enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe, short video, don't build child, and peace out, guys. Wait for 1.2.